USWA Wrestling Action. With me right now, the Truth Commission and the Commandant. Some big matches upcoming, not only uh, championship matches, but a one-on-one -on -one match with you and Steve Dunn as for what oh, happened. No, 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 no. That is absolutely out. You can forget about that. What we have to say here first is, however, that as the number one contenders for the USWA Tag Team title, we have proved our domination throughout the South. Not only that, but today, Jerry Lawler has finally admitted that our domination and superiority now warrants Tank to go for the unified title belt, which you will see here today. <laughs> and that's right, that, uh, that match will be coming up for the unified championship. But you and Steve Dunn, lumberjack match with lumberjacks all around the ring. I don't know. You're in the ring. I do not know where you get this from. I have not signed, I have not agreed to any of this. Stephen Dunn has been trying to get me, the Commandant, the brains behind this operation, into the ring for a long time. I am an officer and a gentleman. My commandos are the people who do that job. There is no way that Stephen Dunn is going to get me to climb into the ring with him. Please, man, he's 20 years younger than me. What does he want? The bloody sissy. Nevertheless, that match has been signed. It will be a lumberjack match. You will be in that. That is upcoming. And let's go ahead and let's talk about Jerry Lawler. Your man Tank has a big match coming up in just a few minutes right yes. here on Champions. He will take that unified world wrestling title away from Jerry Lawler. We will then take it back to Johannesburg, South Africa, our hometown, where there will be a ticker tape parade waiting for us. And after that, we will then tour the rest of Africa to show them that us, we, the Truth Commission, will bring the truth to them that we, our tribe, is the dominating and most superior tribe in the whole of Africa. That remains to be seen. Let's go to the ring. Let's, let's see what happens in this match right now. Jerry the King Waller, the unified champion against your man. Only one outcome. We are the champions. The Commandant and the Truth Commission. This match right here on USWA Wrestling Today, the Unified Heavyweight Championship. Jerry the King Lawler, the champion taking on Tank of the Truth Commission. And this match is for the USWA World Unified Title. Dutch Mantel, you couldn't ask for a bigger match on television. No, you can't ask for a bigger match. I had to move away from the desk there because when the Truth Commission comes around, you know, they, they sort of have to looking around at me. There's three of me, there's only one of me. And I, oh, no, no, no. I don't know what I was thinking. I left Shoe Baby in the back today. I've never done that before, but I was running late today. Oh, we're going to have company. I got the old cheating. That is why my commandos are placed around me to make sure that you will not interfere with us next. Uh, that's dangerous. That's dangerous for Jerry Lawler, I'll tell you, when you've got that whole well, army, if you would, around that ring. You know, a lot of interest right now for the unified title. Jerry Lawler has held it, I don't know how many times. And he's always been able to regain it, but right now the Truth Commission, of course, wanting to set some kind of statement, send some kind of message here in the USWA. And I'm going to tell you what, if they could take this unified title, they would be well on their way to more or less dominating dominating what goes on in the USWA. The Commandant, of course, has stationed recon outside the ring. He has stationed interrogator around the ring. The Commandant around the ring. It is certainly, uh, Jerry Lawler certainly outnumbered just, just by the number of guys outside the ring. Tanks, tanks throwing a punch, Lawler ducking under it. Lawler has never been one to worry about being out man. I mean, if there is a man in professional wrestling that can handle himself in the ring under any circumstances, it's Jerry the King Lawler. But this match, I'll tell you, this is a very important match. It is the Unified Heavyweight Championship, one fall, 30-minute time limit. But the fact of the matter is you've got one of the biggest men in the Truth Commission in there. Look at this power slam on Lawler. That tank is very big. He's huge. Did you see the ring collapse? That's 400 pounds. 400 pounds coming down with not only 400 pounds of pressure, but of course the force of gravity pulling him down too. That ring had to drop at least six inches. The Commandant at ringside. Lalo, I don't mean to talk over you, Michael St. John, but Lalo, good thing he had the presence of mind to move out of the way because he's dropped that elbow on me. It's not a good feeling. Commandant standing on the outside with other members of the Truce Commission. Lalo backed into the ropes by Tank, and the Tank just using those big forearms across the back. Lawler back by the drop and down he goes. That tank sent him for a run. He was at least, look to me, 10, 12 feet in the air. Lawler, I'll tell you, when, when you come down that way and Lawler 
Ferrari's been on the mat a couple of times already in this match. It's got to wear that lower back. And create a lot of pain. Now you see what tank of the Truth Commission is doing now. He put Lawler in for the run. Now going to work on probably what he thinks is the weakest part of his body in the back. Lawler's the with a big right hand. Stunning tank. Wait a minute. Looks like the Commandant over here. Handing tank. Handing his man something here. I think referee Bill Rush, of course, his hands are sort of, he's distracted by the, just the sheer number of the Truth Commission around the ring. Well, the, the fans all on their feet. Every one of the fans on their feet right now. Fans are trying to alert referee Bill Rush that they're there's something awry here. They're trying to what they're trying to do. They're trying to alert Lotto that he's got something. Now Tank disposing of whatever it was that was handed to him by the Commandant from the outside. About Jerry Lawler, he was a notoriously slow starter because I had a series of matches with him some time back. And if you can beat Lawler within the first, you know, if you can beat him within the first 10 minutes, that's when he's at his really his weakest. Well, because he actually, to me, and I think his record will indicate that, all the old tapes and everything, that he actually gets stronger as the match progresses. He is also a very meticulous wrestler. He has a game plan when he enters that ring, and he tries very, very carefully to execute that game plan. Lawler, look out, Lawler. Tank just reached in. He caught him with whatever it was, and down went Lawler in a heap. No doubt about it, Tank had something loaded into that right hand, and if you notice, Tank's got the right hand. Uh, I don't think it's tape, but he's got some kind of gloves to buy. He does have a covering over it. What, what that does, I don't know. And also, his left wrist is taped up too. See, when wrestlers go in the ring, they got to look at their opponent and see exactly if anything is different about them. If something is taped or whatever, that might indicate an injury. It might indicate that he's favoring something to the opponent. And smart wrestlers do that. The pain and recon now taking advantage of the referee's distraction, choking Lawler on the far rope. And again, that's what happens when you have multiple wrestlers at ringside. Not only do you have a manager and your opponent in the ring, but you got multiple wrestlers from the whole Truth Commission at ringside keeping, if you would, watch on this match. So fans, if you tuned in late, this is a unified world title match right here, free on television. It didn't cost you one dime to see it. The reigning champion right now, King Jerry Lawler, putting the title on the line against Tank of the Truth Commission. And as you can see, the interrogator right now choking Lawler. Referee Bill Rush distracted again. So many men, the whole Truth Commission is outside the ring. And that's what you see a lot with the Truth Commission. It's either the Commandant out there. Neckbreaker by Tank, and Lawler is down. He is in a world of trouble right now. Yeah, Tank is sort of taking it to him right now, but not without help. Not without help from the other members of the Truth Commission. See, Michael St. John, you can have a match if I station a bunch of guys around the ring and sort of roll you down or distract you. You can probably win. You can have a match the ring. You see the Commandant choking Lawler and using that riding crop, if you would, as now, a see, weapon. See, I've been warned by Commissioner Elliot Pollock that my interference in these matches you know, will not be tolerated. So I'm, I'm having to sit here. I'm having to sit here and watch this. But this match is more, this match is more than the unified heavyweight champion against an opponent. It's one against four, no matter how you cut it. Yeah, it is one against four. That's, that's pretty good math, Mike. You sort of counting the two points. One, two, three, four. There's four of them. Big slam by Tank. He plants Lawler. Goes for the... Oh! Lawler out from underneath. And here is the result. There it comes. There's the strap is down. Dropping the strap, and here he comes. And that's Katie, bar the door. That's not what my grandmother used to say, Katie, bar the door. And Nobody, and Katie was never around. And this is patented Jerry Lawler right here. Lawler whips him to the turnbuckle. Tank coming out, misses him with the right hand. Oh, there's a oh. drop kick. Did he pull that out of the bag of tricks or what? It's been 10 years since I saw Lawler throw a drop kick. Lawler off the top. Got him with that big right hand. With the patented Lawler fist drop. Here's Recover. the cover. Recon distracting referee Bill Rush. Lawler has got Tank down. Looks like Recon's holding the referee. Over. There's one for Recon. Lawler taking matters into his own hand. There's one for the interrogator. There's the Commandant. Lawler is about ready to unload right here. Uh-oh. The Commandant just tossed that riding 
drop into tag. He caught Lawler in the throat. Common now down the close. Lawler is covered by tag. new champion, ladies and gentlemen, right here on USWA television. Tank of the Truth Commission has just defeated Jerry the King Lawler. And what were we saying? This would be, they have sort of taken over the USWA right now. Lawler down, and the Truth Commission celebrating right now. Well, you gotta say, they're an army because it took an army of four to beat the King, and they have now claimed the USWA unified heavyweight champion. Yeah. We got a new champion. Oh. Let's take this break. We'll try to get things collected and together. We'll be back to sort things out when we come back right after this.